So very happy to have Francois Philippe Champagne joining us as well from the Senate building. He is, of course, Canada's uh, newly minted foreign affairs minister. Mr. Champagne, always good to have you on the program. Thanks for this today. I know it's busy. Uh, uh, give us a sense, if you can, just ahead of this throne speech, what we might be seeing here. No doubt you were part of the conversations in all of this. Well, I would say Canadians should expect no real surprises. I think the prime minister has spoken. Canadians have spoken. They want us to work together. They want us to talk about the middle class, to talk about the environment. I think when you see the votes in different parts of the country, Canadians have sent out a message to, to work together, not to divide, but obviously to focus on what brings us together as Canadians. And I think Canadians will be in, in, in able to see that what you see in the Toronto speech will bring Canadians together. That's really our mission. Uh, they've elected people from different parties, obviously, in the 43rd uh, Parliament. But what they send us overall as a message, work together because we all work for Canadians. And I think people will be happy to see in the Toronto speech today what we have to offer. Obviously, being from Quebec yourself, you know national unity is a big issue in our country for any national government. You're talking about bringing Canadians together. The fact that your party didn't win any uh, seats in Alberta or Saskatchewan, of course, shut out of those two provinces. How do you reach out uh, to those parts of the country and say, listen, well, you know, we, we hear you, we are well, listening I mean, to you? It well, it's, it's the duty of all ministers and all parliamentarians to reach out. Uh, I've already called, for example, the, the mayors in the prairies and in the West as a former infrastructure minister. We each have a network. Uh, Jim Carr is going to play a big role in bringing the voice of the West into cabinet and McClellan as well. But I think it's each of us who have to do more, to do more for us to reach out to our colleagues in Quebec, to do more to reach out to our colleagues in Alberta, in Manitoba, in Saskatchewan, in British Columbia. So we're going to do that collectively. And, and it, it goes also with policies that will bring Canadians together, because that's what Canadians expect in a modern parliament, is to bring people together, focus on what uh, is we have in common, and work on that basis for all Canadians. Francois Philippe Champagne is Canada's newly minted foreign affairs minister. Monsieur Champagne, thank you for taking the time for CTV as always. Great to have you. Thank you. See you very soon. Absolutely.